What's up YouTube? How's it going? Back again for another random video. Here's the unboxing of the 65 inch Hair 4K Ultra HD TV. Picked this up at Costco for 900 bucks. $749.99 plus tax, $750. Uh, and the disposable fee, I think TV's over 50 inches or so. I'm not sure how that works. It's another 40 bucks. And uh, Costco is awesome. Two year warranty, 90 day uh, return policy. So that's awesome. You know, it's a lower end budget TV, but it's just my basement TV. I returned that 55 inch. The reason why I returned the 55 inch is because at Best Buy at Boxing Day, they didn't have the TV, the Roku TV I wanted. So they sold me a Toshiba TV for like six fifty, and they gave it to me for five hundred. But I had to buy the warranty, so it came up to eight hundred bucks. And who needs a four-year warranty on a TV that you know is hardly going to get used? And if it's going to screw up, it's going to screw up within the first year or so anyway. So I returned that, spent the extra hundred bucks, and got a TV ten inches bigger that's four K. Like I said, it's probably not the best quality picture, but Costco has an awesome return policy. And I got to see it in the store, so I was happy with it. And for 900 bucks, you can't go wrong. Whoops. How did this slice through my return policy? <laughs> Guess I gotta go rip this off someone else's TV. <laughs> oh well. Life goes on. I've never, I've owned a lot of TVs in my day LED, LCD. It's probably like my 10th TV. But I've never owned a 65 inch. Ooh, metal stands. Nice. Good job. Hear that? Actual metal. Surprised that it's actually metal. Okay. Take out the phone. <clears throat> On this model itself, the TV UL 65 inch 4K TV UL TRA HD. On the box, it does not say what side to face up and what side to face down because you're not supposed to lie to you flat on its face. Now, I have a soft tonneau cover and I prefer to be standing up, but it was nighttime and I was in a rush and you know. So I pretty much just chose a side to lie it down on. So hopefully, I lie it down on the right side. Oh my god, I don't even know if I can lift this up myself. I'm sure it just comes apart at the bottom here. I think they had this TV at Boxing Day, and then they just kept with the price, so. If it goes down in the next, I don't know, 90 days, I'm sure Costco will honor my price. It's a great company, great return policy, and I'm actually quite excited to see how the picture and how it's going to look. I mean, you know, I'm only like 8 feet away from the TV. Just probably a little too close for a 65 inch. You now every TV always gives you the crappiest batteries. Unless it's Sony. Sony gives you Sony batteries. <laughs> so it's Hayer remote. Hayer. All up in the air. Here's the remote. Basic, basic remote. 
<coughs> so I don't even have the stand on. And it's always a pain in the ass putting the stand on. But where can I lean this? Oh. I'm gonna tell you guys. They don't even put anything on the front of the TV to protect it or the border. Did they put plastic on the border? Yes, they did. So, sorry for my amateur. In the back of the TV, we got four HDMI inputs, USB um, cable. There's HDMI 3, HDMI 4 there, optical out, HDMI 1, HDMI 2, uh, the video modes, components, the composites, and then you can't disconnect the power cable from the back of the TV. Uh, most TVs you can. This TV is pretty damn thin. Even Energy Star rated it for you. The rating is 23. 23 bucks a year. 23 bucks. So before I end this video, let's just look and see how thin this TV is here. That's pretty damn thin. So, it's not very thick. Nice thin TV. Well, there you have it, guys. There's my 65 inch. Costco. <clears throat> Big bad boy. Oh. So, it's energy starred. even on the cheaper TVs, the borders are nice and thin. I'm glad every company adapted to that. Whew. There you have it guys. Nice big size TV. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more random video. And I'll talk to you real soon. Bye for now. Time to go test out this picture. Peace.